You talked a little bit about sort of KPIs then. I mean, um, you know, if, if we've sort of hired this product marketer, we've got them sort of set up for success, the alignment's there, the reporting's fine, we've got the sort of shared shared goals. What sort of things would you perhaps be looking at to sort of track their performance then? Oh, that's, that's really difficult. As I said before, you know, it, that's probably the most challenging with being a PMM is the fact that it is very hard to measure success. Mm. Um, it's more of, you know, is the team content with what you're providing? Um, mm. are, does sales feel that they are becoming more effective? Does marketing feel that they can focus more on what they're supposed to be doing? And that's really, really hard to measure and put clear mm. KPIs on. Mm. Uh, but I would say, you know, uh, setting up some defined deliveries, you know, a sales deck, uh, battle cards, et cetera, et cetera, could be one way of when you first start, these are the things that we have to have done. Mm. Uh, and then it's going to have to be one of those. Are you feeling that you as a marketing team can deliver a better result, a better campaign based on the material that is coming from the PMM side? Yeah. And do you think it's easy enough to sort of track things like, I mean, I'm thinking about if, if you've got a product marketer in place and they're doing what a product marketer should, then the message is better. It's landing with mm. the right people um, more so. Do you think that would sort of influence like velocity and pipeline? Would you be sort of looking at those kind of things or would you be, 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 be sort of keeping that more in this sort of demand gen sort of uh, area? I, I mean, uh, if you, if, when it boils down to it, it's about the sales, right? So mm. are you getting stronger leads? Are you getting, so are the SQLs actually uh, of a, a high enough quality now? Uh, can, can that be measured? Um, you know, when we have a webinar, what is actually coming out of that material? Um, but again, how do you measure, is this campaign better than the last campaign? It's yeah. going to be the sales results, right? So we measure our PMMs on the, the revenue. Yeah. How, how are we doing in sales? Perfect. There's no hiding. <laughs> no, no, because... I mean, yes, you can have those deliveries. And that's why I say, you know, in the beginning, when you have a, a, a very new person, you're going to have those specific deliveries that just needs to be in place. Um, what we see is our PMMs can make sure that the product gets out into the market quicker. Uh, I mean, we're, most of us are now soft companies, right? So a month for us is worth a lot of money. Mm. If we can shorten the, the cycle from idea out to uh, the, the customer actually get real value or, you know, day zero for the customer. If we can shorten that time period with a month or two, that can be extremely valuable for us. Hmm. But again, then you would have to do an A-B testing. How quick would this go if you didn't have the PMM? So it is difficult to measure it. Hmm. 